Okay. Can you say your name and the course you're studying to start with that other video? Um, Rochelle Delima and I'm doing art and media. Okay. okay. Um, hi Rochelle, how are you? I'm good. Excellent. Um, can I ask you what interests you about this position that you're applying for? Um, the designing aspect of it, so the fact that we can um, apply our own designs and styles okay. to the reading cards. Okay. Um, so do you, uh, are you that, that's your main interest is the design side of things, yes? Yeah. Okay. Um, and what, uh, what qualifications do you feel you have uh, that will help you perform this role? Um, I have good leadership skills, so if working in a team, um, I could apply that. And um, I'm doing art and media, so I have like my own original ideas that could also help with the um, designing aspect of okay. the card. Do you have any other qualifications in art? Um, no, okay. but I've done um, textiles okay, so at textile. GCSE level. Okay. Um, and what skills, obviously you're going to work as part of a team and you're going to, as you mentioned, leadership. What skills, what are your main skills that you think you could bring to this role? Um, confidence. And I have a positive um, trait that I carry with me. Okay. Um, and I'm a good listener and understanding person. Okay, good listener. So what you're saying is you're, you're open to listening to other people's ideas yeah. and you don't, okay. Listen, all right, fantastic. And, and would you say those that those are your main strengths, those three things? Oh, and speaking. Yeah, speaking is also, yeah. Okay, so those, those are your, your main strengths. And my next question is actually what are your main strengths, but just going back to the skills in terms of practical design skills, okay. Uh, I just want to explore this skill area. But what, what would you say? Your you, you didn't do art at, at school, um, but you did do textile. So I, I imagine there's a fair bit of design element to that. Yeah. What What are your actual skills like? Um, well, I can like sketch out things, okay. draw. Um, because I've done textiles, I know how to sew and put things together. Okay. So constructing a product. Okay. And um, yeah. Okay. Um, and can you tell me your um, your two main strengths as a person? Um, I think my two main strengths are my my confidence and my speaking skills. Okay. Okay. Excellent. Fantastic. Um, obviously, you're not going to. You're only you're only sixteen or seventeen. 16, so you've still got a lot to learn. Um, what would you say your main challenges are going to be um, in this role? Um, well, it, pleasing my bosses with my own ideas and stuff, so yeah. hoping that they will like what I do. Okay, so your style. Do you feel you have a style? Do you have your own style already? Have you developed that style yet? I, I'm, like, I'm getting there, like I'm just starting off, so... I don't think, like I do have my own style, but I don't think it's noticeable yet. Okay. What, what would you say your style is? Um, I think my style is really simple and modest. Well, no, what, what's okay. Simple and modern, so it's like um, basically what teenagers kind of like, so... Okay, what do teenagers like? Um, I don't know, things that are really like fun, colourful, so stuff like that, yeah. Excellent. Um, obviously you're still in school, you're applying for this role. Um, if I went to your school and asked um, some of your teachers to describe you in two words, what would those two words be? Um, I think they'd say I'm quite a bright student and okay. that... Um, I work quite hard. Hard working. Okay, fantastic. Um, why 
as we give you this job, why should I employ you? What do you feel um, is going to set you above another candidate? Why should I employ you for this job? Um, because I'm a person with not only the skills to do um, designing and stuff, but a person that can also be a leader. And I have really good ICT skills because I use that every day. So I'm familiar with the different programs used, such as Photoshop and um, um, Fireworks and stuff like that. Okay. Um, obviously, the, the role does require, just the first thing you've mentioned, the ICT skills. I'm pleased you mentioned that because the role does require some with excellent ICT skills. So Photoshop, you say you, you've worked with. Yeah. And what was the other one you mentioned? Um, Fireworks. Fireworks, okay. Dirty. Yeah. Um, which, which, uh, which other ICT package are you familiar with? Um, I'm familiar with Microsoft Word, all the words, so Excel, okay. all the Microsoft Office ones, and... What about desktop publishing, that, that, that side of things, the, the more graphics packages, which graphics packages have you used? Um, I've used 2D Design, okay. and yeah, that's basically it. Okay. And do you have any experience on, on Macs? Yep. I use the Mac and the Mac, Mac, so yeah. Okay. And uh, do you do you prefer using the Mac to um to a, a regular um, PC? I do, but um, sometimes a PC is better because okay. some programs you can only use on a PC rather than Mac. So okay. yeah, I'm familiar with both of them. Okay, fantastic. Um Okay, do you have any questions you'd like to ask me about the position? Um, yeah, I would like to ask you, what exactly am I going to be like able to do okay. as a... Well, you'll be part, you'll be, you, you know, you're a design assistant. Um, so, I suppose at this point, you would be um, helping the main designers. That they would maybe come up with a design that you might have to try and change their design slightly to make it um, so we can print it and then you will take it to you'll help with the production side of things so you wouldn't necessarily um, be doing the initial designs in, in the first part of your job as you've got more experience you would do but not initially you would be helping you be working alongside the designer to you prove yourself that you're capable to do that okay um right is there any anything else you'd like to tell me about yourself um well, I think that's pretty much it. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Thank you very much. Um, that was very good. I've got some um, things I'd like to just go through after, you, after you've finished, but we'll have a little chat later on. But well done. Thank you. I will let you know by phone or email if you get the job. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you. Okay. Okay. Well done.